Hi everyone, Miss here. Thanks for stopping by. So today I've received a smiley package and it's an Amazon smile. Um, or as Hubby says, it's an our Amazon package. Oh no, it's a frown. <laughs> So this one is another of the two kit uh, canvases that uh, I've received quite frequently from Amazon. Uh, it's two different canvases and again I used one of the Vipon coupons. Um, I'm not affiliated or associated in any way with Vipon. I don't receive any free products or any commission or anything from them. Um, I just like to share when I've got some special offers. So it's always worth checking them out and um, to see what offers are on. And these two canvases would normally be £8.89 for the two. And I got them for £4.44, which I think is a bargain. And we all love a bargain. OK, so let's get into the bag and have a look. See what we've got. If I can find the end. There it is. OK. Sorry about the crinkling. Right, which one shall we do? Which one shall we do? Do this one first. This one looks the fattest. Okay. And the poured glue, which most of the Amazon canvases seem to be poured glue, which is great. I do prefer poured glue. That's where you get the clear. Oops, this one's decided to stay in the packet. Oh no! Let's uh, get that off there quickly. Don't want that looking up at the corner. Right. Yeah, I prefer the poured glue because it's um, a bit more robust. Oh, look at that little face. And if you know me or you've followed my channel for a while, you'll know I'm an animal lover and I'm a dog lover and I'm a Scotty dog lover. But this is a little Yorkshire Terrier, a little Yorkie. And when I was growing up, um, my grandma's sister, my great aunt, had a little Yorkshire Terrier. Well, she was cross between a Yorkshire Terrier um, and a Jack Russell, but she looked very Yorkie like, and I absolutely loved her. And I stayed at my great aunties, my aunties, an awful lot just so I could play with the dog. And this one just reminded me of it. So I thought, yeah, I'm going to have to have that canvas because that just looks like she was called Cindy. She was absolutely beautiful. And that uh, she lived an awful long time. But yeah, I've always been a dog lover. Okay, so we've got a very basic toolkit, a pink pen with no multi-placer, a green boat and a little pink wax. One of the quite uh, see-through pink waxes. The drills are round and they're in the grey and silver packaging. And let's see if we can just flatten this out a bit with this clear plastic. To switch. Okay. I've just heard a door slam downstairs, so I don't know what Hubby's up to. Um, we've been having a bit of a, a to do with um, the wheelchair people at the moment. That wasn't very good. Ugh. That's better. Okay, we've got that flattened out a bit better. Yeah, um, we've got. Um, the like, occupational therapist, occupational services coming tomorrow to help Hubby with this new electric wheelchair. This will be the third one that they've um, supposedly sent us. And the wheelchair hasn't arrived. So we've got two people coming tomorrow to help us with a new wheelchair that we've not got yet. So we've been on the phone trying to get through to them all day um, to tell them we've not received this wheelchair. And uh, yeah, so we'll see what happens. Hey ho, nothing ever goes smoothly. But that's another story. <laughs> okay, so this one is 24 colours and it's all numbers down to eight and then all capital letters, which is great. Looks like a lovely clear drill field. Oh, look at that little squidgy nose. And there's no training circles on it, so this will be a lovely one to do. I must admit, um, I know a lot of people like doing the huge canvases and I will do a huge canvas one day. But at the moment, um, the way my circumstances are and the way things are here, I just like doing my 30 by 40 poured glues. 
I can do them in about a week at the most and I just feel a really great sense of achievement. I find it really relaxing to just sit and do whatever size canvas you do. It's still the same. You're just literally putting a little bead or drill or a gem onto a sticky canvas, be it poured glue or double-sided tape. And it's the same to do it. Single placing, multi-placing, whatever you do, it's the same action, it's the same thing. It doesn't matter what size canvas you are. So you are still a diamond painter and you are still achieving something. And most diamond paintings, I won't say all, because I've not done them all. <laughs> but most diamond paintings come out lovely. And I'm uh, quite looking forward to doing this one. And like most things, you look at every new canvas you get and think, I want to do that one next. And it's not possible to do them all, but I will get them done. And I will show you and let you know what I think. But yeah, that is really pretty really good okay so let's have a look at this yeah i mean i do admire oops let's get these out first before i saw crinkle 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 sorry okay yeah i do admire people that do these huge canvases but at the moment i'm not in the mindset where I think I could spend months doing one canvas. I just like to have my quick hits and my enjoyment and know that I can finish something and achieve something. Um, I think if I had one of those massive ones at the moment, the way my mindset is, I would probably just spend hours and just stay up all night trying to do it and get it finished. And that wouldn't be good for me. So yeah, this is what I need to do at the moment. Well, this is why I buy a lot of this size. Um, but yeah, they're also, I get an awful lot of these for my money as well. <laughs> okay, so what have we got on the, uh, there? Yeah, I've got the, yeah, we've got the canvas number on the drills. So yeah, that's DBA11909. And we've got the DMC number there as well. Okay. So let's have a look at these. Oh, are we all one long snake? I think we might be. Is this number one that we're starting at? Yeah, yeah that's number one. So these are all going to be like greys and browns, I think. Um, and then the background colour and like the rusty colours. And oh, we've got a, a maroony colour there. That one's quite nice. And oh, we've got bright orange as well. That'll be the highlights for the little Yorkie. Okay, and a pale pink. And like a very pale mauve and a very pale peach colour. And again, rust don't know, it's in two lengths. And yeah, and they're looking quite nice. They're acrylic drills. And then I've got like a rosy pinky colour, a brown. And then the background is, what's that, 3865? Yeah, 3865, which is your off-white colour there. Yeah, they look pretty good okay drills um, I say the ones that I've been getting recently um, in bags similar to this I'm finding aren't really much trash I just seem to get really little tiny teeny tiny round drills <laughs> just like bits dropped off okay so that's canvas number one put those drills out the way and let's have a look at canvas number two okay Where's the end on this one? Come on, where have you hidden it? It must be there somewhere. Is it up there? Is it down here? Oh, this is silly. Oh, there it is. Look. <laughs> They're just hiding it away from me. Okay. Right, and this one is a completely different one. This one's a giraffe. Look how pretty she is. And I've got a funny feeling I might have one very similar to this, but in square. So that'll be different to do. This one is 23 colours. And again, it's called glue. So let's just see if I can flatten this out a bit. Oh, I've just missed that corner there, look. Okay, it's quite a stiff canvas, this one, same as the other one. Uh, oh, and I didn't measure the yard, okay, so we'll measure this one because they'll both be the same. 
what you tend to find with poured glue is that the size, and I don't know why they do it really, you'd think they'd just say what size the drill field is. But, uh, yeah, you tend to find that the actual size that it says on the canvas, 30 by 40, is the full canvas size. The actual uh, drill area is sort of like three, two and a half, three centimetres smaller. So let's just uh, measure. So Yorkie will probably be the same. So this one, yeah, is 25 centimetres, just under 10 inches by... Uh, 24 and a half sorry 34 and a half centimeters which is about 13 and a half inches so yeah you lose the edges but what I've found now is um, particularly on Amazon and some of the other sellers as well when you look through the different um, scenes the different photographs that they show you they do actually now do a grid where it shows you the canvas size and the drill area size so that you can see We've got your key code top and bottom, which is great. So when you're working on it, whichever way, uh, you can see it. But I think that giraffe is very, very pretty. She's got roses in her hair, look, and all the different leaves and things coming down the sides. Look at those eyelashes. Eyelashes to die for, girls. Look at those. Wow. Okay. And, ooh. Oh, it is in there. I thought it was inside there. Then same basic tool kit. Right, this one's got a bit of squashed wax in the corner there. And this one has the white uh, drills, so different drills. And by white, I mean that the stripe on the bag is actually the white drills. Um, you tend to find, or I've found in the past, that the drills that are in the um, grey stripe with the blue tend to be a little bit better quality. But uh, you never know. I mean, things have moved on such a lot and so fast because there's so many different companies coming out now. And particularly here in the UK, diamond painting seems to be a hobby that's now taking off. I think it's been in the um, United States a lot longer than it's been in the UK. You know, it, it's gradually built up here. Um, but, oh. Sorry, I've got Millie outside growling at me. But uh, yeah, certainly here in the UK, it's really taking off now. There's a lot more companies doing it and there's a lot more shops stocking them as well. Okay, so have we got... Yeah, we've got DBA 11905 on the drills and on the canvas. So that's good. Okay. Wow, 23 colours. So let's have a look at these. So we have a pink and a grey. And lots of greens and aquas because the background is a lovely. Oh, look at that colour. That's going to be smashing, isn't it? Really pretty for the background. And another brown. And greys and beiges and oh, hot pink. That'll be the flowers. And brown and beige. And like a slaty blue. And more browns. And like a very pale peach. And beige and like a very pale rust and then we've got just those colours sort of a rusty colour and a peach and a brown and a very dark brown and a orangey pinky colour okay so that's the giraffe okay, so just a quick video today of uh, the two canvases just a quick video today of the two canvases that I've received so Quite a strange combination really to get a giraffe and a Yorkshire Terrier in the same packet but I love them both so that's fine and um, but if you've enjoyed seeing these if you give me a thumbs up it'd be much appreciated and if you want to come back and see what I get up to next and see when I've completed these then if you press the subscribe button down in that corner and the little bell next to it you'll be notified when my next videos come up so thanks for stopping by hope to see you all again soon bye for now